Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Jason with Honest Try TV, and today we'll, I'll be reviewing, testing, and prepping the uh, beer braised short rib uh, from crafted by Chris Riddell. Uh, Riddell, and this is from Cook Unity. It looks like it has a uh, 1,010 calories and 86 grams of proteins. Nice. Um, so I started up the oven already, with, and we're at about 158. We're supposed to get it to 350 uh, before I pop it in there. I'm going to follow the steps, uh, steps uh, instructions. And it says remove the sleeve and film. So let's open this bad boy up. Look at that. Looks pretty good. It has juices in there and everything. All right. So we're going to remove the film. Sleep and film, and it says right after that it says we're gonna heat uh, heat up for 15 to 20 minutes until heated thoroughly. So I'll probably do it for 18 minutes. But just looking at it, it looks pretty good. There's moisture, there's juices in there flowing. So I guess we'll see how it comes out to be after it's all uh, baked. So I'll get back to you guys when the oven's ready, and um, we'll go from there. Hey guys, so the oven is ready to go at 350 and um, I will put it in the oven for about, what does it say, 15 to 20? I'll do, I'll do 18 minutes to see what we get us. And I double checked everything, it looks really good. The carrot, this, this potato looks like a, like a, like a bun, it's really good. But I'll get back to you guys in a bit. Uh, if you like this type of um, videos, like and subscribe and comment down below. Thanks. All right, you guys, 18 minutes are up, and this is what we got. Looks pretty good. So I was just told that actually that this this meal was uh, given to us uh, by accident. Nicole actually ordered us the lamb. I don't remember the full name was that. Sabzi. Lamb Sabzi. But we got this one instead. Hopefully it's a better uh, contender. So let me get a little bite of each real quickly. To let you know how it tastes. Potatoes. Oh. Alright. No, it's alright. It's alright. It's a little bland. It's okay. Let's take up let's taste this short rib with some of the sauce down there. Oh yeah, that's good. That is some good short rib. That sauce definitely helps it for sure. That's good. Really good. Let me get a little bit of a... I think these are carrots? What are these? I don't know. I think they're carrots. Mm, yeah, they're alright. So, my initial taste of it, it's pretty good. Definitely short ribs is a, it's a definitely win. I'm going to go ahead and enjoy the, the, as, much of the, as much of the meal as I can, and I'll get back to you after my stomach's full to give you the full review of what I thought about it. But this is uh, Jason. I'll be right back. Hey, guys. This is Jason. I'm back. So I completely, well, nearly completed, finished eating the entire bowl plate. You can see there that I left the potatoes, but everything else, the, the vegetables, the short rib, very good very 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 good the potato though so I'm not a big uh, starch guy not it comes with rice and potatoes uh, but this potato uh, it was just so bland like it, it didn't taste it tastes like potato obviously it's potato but it didn't have like any salt or pepper or anything around it like maybe uh, if you mix it up with the the uh, the broth that was in here probably would taste better but it was just way too bland for me, and I, I couldn't do it. But, uh, yeah, so let's see. To answer some questions about would I recommend this to somebody else, like a friend, I would say yes. I would say definitely, because you could always fix the potatoes yourself, put some, uh, put some sprinkle there, some uh, salt and pepper, add a little stick of butter. Like my uh, Nicole's from the South, so her mom always cooks with everything with butter, and that always makes, improves everything. Um, how would I rate it from 1 to 10? 
I would just say, I'll probably say like a seven and a half, seven and a half, eight. Uh, and again, the big chunk of it is because the potato in this in this case had no seasoning. But everything else is really good. Everything else is really, really good. I mean, I guess, like I said, one couldn't just mix everything in with the broth that was with the, with the short ribs. And would I order it again? Yes. I would order it again because I would just uh, modify the potatoes. Like I said, salt and pepper, good to go. So this this was the beer braised short rib, and it was made. It was crafted by Chris Rattel, and this is from Cook Unity, and that was my review of it. Um, again, I would order it again. It was good. I enjoyed the short rib, and if so, if you like this type of uh, review, uh, please like and subscribe. And if you have any type of uh, any comments of you know what future other meal purpose we should do review, leave it down below. Um, again, this is Jason. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.